guys it's beast pet here so in this video i'm going to show you how to fix lag or how to run rainbow six search on your low end pc for running this game with my tweaks you will need at least 4 gb of ram and 512 mb of graphics card with a i3 processor I, my pc is 4 gb ram and 512 mb graphics with a 2.0 megahertz first but recently one week ago i upgraded my pc to 8 gb ram so uh, i'm going to show you my specification so here you guys can see i'm having 8 gb ram with AMD R5 graphics and a processor of AMD A8 with 2.00 GHz which is lower than i3 yes and that's it now we have to now let's go to document come here or in the sidebar documents then you have to find my games and Rainbow Six Size folder Then in uh, this folder, which uh, which is uh, written in many numbers, then game settings. But before that, you have to see that it is read only or not. If it's read only, then untick it. Untick the read only if it is. Now edit it with Notepad plus plus or Notepad. Okay. Now this game is it's really optimized game. It's pretty optimized game. But the main thing is it. Resolution. The resolution of this game is limited. Means you can't lower it that from 720p is the lowest resolution in this game. So now you can lower the resolution. What you can do is keep it like like it is in my PC. Keep the height to 480. If you keep it in 480, that means it will run in 480p. And if you can change it to 360, but I would recommend it to 480 and in uh, you guys can see the in my left side or right side there are some resolution list you can keep that resolution up and uh, change it to 480 and in the weight side which is 1076 you can keep it 1076 but if you are having 8 gb ram then only you will keep it to 1076 8 gb or 6 gb ram then only you will keep it to 1076 or else you can change it to 800 or you can change it to 764 anything like that but i will recommend you to change it to 1076 because in 6 in 640 or 800 it barely you can see it see anything so i am giving it 1076 now uh set every graphics settings to lowest settings and then let's go down and you have to change the dynamic resolution oh uh, sorry First of all, you have to change the window. You don't run it in window mode. Run it in full, full screen. Then change the dynamic resolution target FPS to 30. Make sure it is in 30. And then let's go down. Let's go down and set all the graphics in low. Yeah. Now here you have to set the FPS limit to 30. I have said in earlier videos that 30 fps is better than random fps drop and it also doesn't overheat your laptop or your pc ah this is pretty much all now you can save the file and just run the game but i'm not recommend you to run the game now only first of all save the file with ctrl s or going to the files after saving the file you need to go to properties of the file and click or read only and hidden make sure you have done this too because or else if you didn't hidden or write read only then ubisoft will definitely change it to the default now close the window means close this window so, and now go, you have to you have to download a software naming memory that which i have said in my earlier video what it does this clear your ram and in 
increase your performance of your PC a lot. So how does it work? Let me show you. Go to Tax Manager. Let's go to Tax Manager. And you can see the anti malware service is taking 61 to 82.7 MB. Now clean memory. Boom. Now see it's taking only 90.6 MB. So this is what it does. Now I'm the state which is which is required is go to settings which you have to do uh, in all the games you play if you're having a Windows 10 go to game mode and go to graphic settings then browse and select that three exe files of the from the game folder go to the game folder there it is now you have to select board three of these files i've already selected it so i'm not i want to see you guys can see that it's the specific application is already added let me find that application where is it where are you where, are you? where is it where is it i can see it where it is comp right and now other division okay this so rainbow six and you guys can see high performance go to option after adding in you have to save it to high performance it will be in system default you have to save it to high performance yes and now the last and the final stage so uh, let me show you the last and final stage is now you have to go to search or go to battery in call and go to power option or you can search it go to power option and select it to high performance i will not recommend you selecting ultimate performance if you are having a high high end pc then only the ultimate performance works or else it doesn't support it and it just changes it to balance so if you are not having in case you are not having the high performance option we need to create one how to create go to create a power plane option in the right side create a power plan option click it and select the high performance and then select uh, write any of the name or you can click it uh, in the default i'm writing it's time for sage i'm writing this name and do it both never and then create boom it's created now all the steps are done now you guys can finally run the game or uh, another thing, another thing. There are two uh, two exe file. One is Valkyrie version, and one is the DirectX version. What DirectX version or Valkyrie version? Valkyrie version is for AMD high-end AMD processor. Only high-end AMD processor. If you are having a Ryzen processor, then only run the AMD Valkyrie. This Valkyrie, sorry, and the Rainbow Six has Valkyrie version is only for AMD Ryzen processor. And if you're having a cheap processor like AMD A8, don't run the Vulcan, run the DirectX version. Or even if you're having Intel, then also run the normal version, means the DirectX version. So that's it for today. Okay, let me show you one small gameplay of this settings. If this video really helped you to increase the performance of the game on your PC, then please like and subscribe my channel for more content like this and comment down the game which you want to be tweaked by me thank you while you and me repeat this bit of sweet heat is suffocating waiting and always hesitating Kryptonite desires set my heart afire Heart on fire Set my heart afire
sweet heat is suffocating Heart waiting and always hesitating Kryptonite desires set my heart afire 